Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Imperion Galactic Survival. My name is Mike Tannick. Today is Sunday, which means this is the same day that you're going to see this, which means, yes, we are back uh, from the hospital with our plus one. And I want to give a very special thank you to our entire community, everyone who reached out uh, with all the kind words and support. Um, if I did not respond to you uh, in the comments uh, by person, uh, then I want to thank you here. If I missed you, I do apologize. Uh, any of you out there who have had children before knows that uh, the first week or the rest of your life can be a little bit confusing after this happens. So no sleep, lots of caffeine. I'm a little spacey, but um, thank you guys so much. You don't know what it means to me to have such an awesome community um, to have your back. And uh, I'm just really humbled. So I will not get mushy on you guys. So... I do have bad news. Uh, this is my second uh, attempted recording today. Uh, so a few things did happen since we last spoke. Um, I will sum up the last episode here. Let's get with Steve here. Steve kind of knows what happened. He was there. Uh, basically what happened was, let's start with the base. Um, I was able, uh, a couple of you did point out that uh, we were woefully over uh, our CPU limit to the point where we were at like 49% CPU efficiency. We did have, fortunately, the stuff to make a tier two CPU extender. Uh, so we are now well in the clear. In fact, we are barely using half of what we possibly can. Um, uh, in case you, not, you guys didn't catch it in the comments, my plan is not to keep this place. It's nice and all. I wanted a nice... We are in an ocean planet. You know, the ocean's somewhere around here. There, I can see the ocean. I wanted something with a lot of windows that's really nice. However, we are in Xerax space on a Xerax planet, and we were in Xerax territory. We're not at the moment, and I'll get to that in a sec. But what that means is we are going to get kicked in the teeth here. And uh, this is not necessarily the building that I want to trust all my holiest of holies to. It is just not. It's it's not great. This is for this is kind of like a starter planet base. Um, I did do a little bit of hardening up here, as you can see. Some of these windows, it's because Steve's always you know bitching about everything. Like, oh, what if the Xerax come? These windows don't look very sturdy. So I. Uh, did the uh, I sturdied them up at least some of them uh, we are short on titanium so I up up armored the doors up armored the windows some of these blocks mostly to protect the core and Steve oh but if they get in I don't know how to use a gun I tried to teach you how to use a gun and you wouldn't do it and I'm a bit tired of your little of your aw shucks attitude here Steve you know I took a chance on you hiring you I know you just got out of the joint and I know you got a family to support but this isn't the way to do it your stay here is gonna be real short so when they come you get excited and you get on my level you get me Steve good all right so yeah we up armored some of the windows uh, some of the blocks um, we again I, I just want to get this thing hardened up enough to be a weapons platform that's all it's gonna be I'm going to strip all this stuff out, and we are going to move out uh, whoop, into that mountain. We're going to move into the mountains, guys. And when I say into the mountains, I mean into the mountain. And uh, this will be a uh, kind of close-by weapon support system. It's probably a little bit too far away to be of any practical support, but hey, it's just one more place to kind of distract the Xerax while they're here. Or when they come, I should say, and when they attack, because if they do send like the full wave attacks with like the bombers and the drop ships and tons of drones, this thing, I'd rather this thing take the hits. Um, so what we're going to do is to make sure that it is somewhat self-sufficient so that when I leave here, I don't really have to worry about it again. And yes, Steve, you are coming to the new base. Um, so we're going to set up a solar... A, solar panel array here. I did make the stuff for it already, so you don't have to wait for that. Um, but here is the problem that we had, and here's... Uh, let me finish telling you what happened last episode. We took out the Epsilon resistor here. Not really any good loot. There were some good base parts, 
Uh, the blast door gave us a couple flux, flux coils when I salvaged it. Um, otherwise, it was just junk. And I did that mostly just to have this island all to our own. And I did some exploring, guys. And in the last episode that didn't take, I set down some auto miners. Uh, I did one on titanium here. It's a very small deposit, so that's going to be a slow yield. But we need titanium for a number of things, uh, mostly to build a better tier um, auto miners. So we're sending out auto miners to make better auto miners. Unfortunately, the Xerax seemed to be hogging all of it on what I call Xerax Island. I found basically their <laughs> headquarters on this planet. I would call this the, the headquarters because they have three Prometheum and three or possibly four smashed together titanium deposits. Uh, we are not going to be able to take on this island for some time, guys. Not till we get our gnarly hover tank. There is a completely unguarded Arrestrum deposit here, also very small. I set a, down an auto miner there. Now, I wanted to set down a Prometheum or an auto miner here on this Prometheum deposit, but this is a ghost deposit, guys. It's one of those deposits where it says it's there, it's on the map, but when you get there, it's actually there's nothing. There's nothing, and we need a reliable source of. Prometheum for our time here, which is going to be quite a while. So this is what we have to do, guys. We have to get in and get to this deposit and get an auto miner down on it. Now, there are some Xerax defenses here. That is obviously going to be a problem. But if we can get to that defense right there and get it taken out with our cannon turrets on the strato bomber, strato whatever it is, our, our CV, then I think that is far enough away from the rest of these that we can get that down. And depending on how well some of these other ones are armed, uh, we might actually go after them as well, assuming that our, the shields on our CV can hold up long enough to take out the defenses. We're gonna see, that is gonna be today's mission, guys. Uh, there is uh, an Epsilon large spaceport guarding this Prometheum deposit, and it's a medium one, so I really want it, but I don't, think we can take that on although hmm hmm level 7 bioweapons lab versus epsilon large spaceports with an epsilon resistor nearby the resistors have two turrets whereas the xerx defense they have one turret apiece so i'm tempted to go for this one first even though it's the smaller one it's far enough away that I know that we don't have to take out a larger uh, POI if we don't, if we're just not able to uh, take out the weapons on them with our CV. So it is the safe bet, not necessarily the most exciting bet, but we're still going to go after that POI if we're able to. So here's what we're going to do. Let's get busy on this. Okay, we got a lot of concrete blocks. Uh, do we have a capacitor in this thing? I'm. We must, right? Uh, pass it. No, we do not. Okay, well, it's a good thing I saw that. Otherwise, our solar power is going right out the window. So let's make uh, probably two capacitors and some cores. Yeah, let's make some cores. Uh, hang on. Ah. No, no, you know what? Let's just. We'll do it my way, Mike. We'll do it my way. Uh, core. All right, get busy on that. Let's go build us a solar panel array. Now we are in good position here on the planet. Uh, good enough, I think we're towards the middle, are we not? Yeah, we're actually almost right on the equator, so sunlight should not be a problem for us. And this is fairly flat ground here, so I'm gonna try to build this as close to here as possible. So let's do this. Um, yep, I'll do that. Yeah, guys, I'm really disappointed. Uh, you know, just call it whatever you want to call it. Me getting back into the swing of things. I haven't recorded in a week, which is the longest time I've ever gone without recording on this channel. So <laughs> I have to forgive that. And at the end of the day, you guys didn't really miss anything all that exciting. In fact, I plan on this being the more exciting episode. Plan. Ah! Oh, God, there's a mosquito. Jesus Christ. Uh, Take you. And you get out of here. All right. Okay, so let's do this. Let's just get this down real quick. Uh, we'll start here. All right. 
Okay, I'll start here. Go out and over. Four. And out and over this way, two. Uh, those couldn't go in. Uh, okay, so I won't waste the blocks then. All right, that should be almost, well, we gotta go out a little bit more. In fact, I'm building this too wide. What am I doing? Or no, I'm not. It's gotta be six wide for maximum structural integrity. Okay, how's that? There we go. Okay. Why can you not go there? What, what, what seems to be the issue here? Is there stuff in the way? There is. Okay. Uh, that's fine. And here, there's probably stuff in the way as well. And we're also out of blocks. Man, that, that went fast. Uh, okay. I gotta do a bit of clearing. Yep. And I don't have a chainsaw. Well, I, this is better than a chainsaw. I don't need no sting of chainsaw. Oop. I'll take that. Get rid of you. Oop. All right, I knew we'd need more blocks. I, I built this all kinds of stupid. What was, What is this? What is this? There. Now let me get these up. You. All right, yeah, I, I would like to be power independent for this base and our, I think for our mountain base too. I think I can make that happen. Um, but this will be kind of like a red herring for the Xerax to uh, kind of choke on. Hopefully choke on. I hope they choke. And we'll do this. And yep. Still doing it dumbly. What is that? Steel blocks? No, don't. Yeah, don't do that. Okay. All right, let's see about getting these down. I'm probably, I, I thought I had my measurements right before I started this, but of course I do not. All right. Yeah, actually I put you. Normally I do this by drone, but I wanna make sure that we get them down. Enough. Okay, that's not gonna be supported now, is it? Actually it will, I can build under it. Yeah, that'll be supported enough. Okay, yeah, it, it did need to be six wide. If As long as, if I want to maintain, keep these things from uh, collapsing like they did on our last base. There we go. Get you down. Why? Why, 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 why are you being that way that you are? What? Oh my god, come on. I know you can do it. Is there something in the way? There has to be. I am not having a floating thing because I know it's just going to collapse. What is... Oh, I know what it is, I bet. Where's me drill? And, you know, we're just going to need more blocks. Okay, real exciting, guys. I know, watching solar panels go up. But, hey, like I always say, I want you guys to be part of e almost every last little thing that we do. I try to limit your exposure to mining. Because mining is just, that's not cool to do to anyone. Uh, okay, more blocks. How much? Oh, we got crushed stone for days. There we go. And why not? We'll need them eventually. So let's go ahead and get the capacitors down as well. Um, <laughs> there you are. Because right now we are actually burning. Uh, we are wasting our solar power. Oh, oh half blocks. You will rue the day. Um, okay, yeah, just to keep 
from having all of our stuff in one spot because those windows are not secured yet. I do not want it all to go uh, exploding. I also do not want it in front of our fridge, so we'll do that. All right, one on each side. Okay, good, good, good. So how many we set down? Seven? Seven, all right. So we need two more. That's one, two, three, four, and then we'll do five facing straight up. Uh, probably should have moved it a little further away from base, but that's okay. Um, all right. Get you down here. There we go. Just pressing buttons, guys. <laughs> I knew it would take me a little bit of time to get back into the swing of things. All right, what is it that is right there that's causing this madness? Why? Huh. I don't like that. I'm sure if I go down. Let me see my light. Give me my light. Uh, get away. What is it? What could it be? Or is it just an Empyrean glitch? I'm tempted to say it's a glitch. So there's no reason we shouldn't be able to put a block there, but that's okay. All right, let's just build around that particular spot. We're gonna have a missing block. That's okay, we don't even have to look at this base, guys. Don't even have to look at it. And we'll go here and here. And let's get this straightened out. All right, that's gonna have to do. Finish this off. Matter of fact, let's get the rest of these here. All right. Okay, I'll do that, and then another three this direction, and we can't, of course, because that. Oh yeah, we can. All right, that's now a load-bearing silicon rock. Yeah, we're not going to be able to set it down there, unfortunately. That's just, oh god, that's aggravating. So aggravating. They can't be, it has to be perfect, guys. It has to be perfect. <sighs> Alright, this is just turning into a mess. So what I'm going to do here is just use the rest, oh, use the rest of the blocks to do a flat solar array. And we're going to need, definitely need more for that. No. There we go. Oh, hush. Okay, so we'll do this. And three wide. And it's just going to have an extra one on this side. Come in. And then this way, there we go. Three wide. Or maybe not. Yeah, cause how, one, two, three, four, five. I'll do, oh, Christ's sakes. Yeah, we'll do it five wide instead. Two, three, four. And then we'll do this. Uh, if I get eaten by dinosaurs, I swear to God. Okay. Okay, obviously we do not have enough for that. So let's get the rest of these. We'll fill in here like that. Uh, are we on the verge of collapse? No. Okay. Okay. And however many this fits is however many we're going to have. Okay. So let's do this. All right. One, two, three, four, and five. Okay, perfect. I think we nailed it. Okay, that's good enough. 
And we have a few extra blocks, which, uh, yeah, we'll take back. Why not? We're going to need them for our other base. So let's do this. Okay, now that the... I'm sorry, guys. I, I know that uh, the excitement can only go down from here. That was just absolutely thrilling. And I do not like the way that these are just kind of hanging there, so I'm glad I'm taking these blocks back. Because uh, a rocket or two is going to sink that. So let's do this. <laughs> I can... Those blocks we took back. Oh, and a lot more. Okay. There we go. That should firm this up. Not going to bother checking the structural integrity because I trust that that is fine and all is well. This is not a pretty solar array by any stretch of the imagination, but it's going to have to do. All right. Next. Let's go ahead and load up the uh, the Merc with uh, the cores, and I probably should have built rockets, guys, but for for the Merc, but we do not have the uh, the magnesium really, so it wouldn't have made a difference. It wouldn't have been a good thing for us to do. Nice, Steve. Any calls? Do you like your new solar array? Okay, where we gotta go, or I gotta go. Oh. I'll let you know how it goes. Okay, how is our garden doing? We got spice. Ooh. Okay, so this is growing. This is our ration and medicine garden, guys. We're trying to build both. We got... All right, good. We got some herbal leaves. Uh, actually, let me go ahead and eat whatever we have available. What can we make? Let's go in the fridge one. Playa. Oh, god damn it. It went into the modular station. Here we go. Uh, you, 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 you. Okay, the cores, that'll go to me. Alright. And our food processor is on the other side, of course. I really gotta move that. But not right now. I'm not gonna worry about that right now. What can you make us? Burger! Ooh, canned soup, first and foremost. Make me some canned veggies, then a burger if you can. Um, oh, I could have a beer. Oh, you know what? I'll have a beer when I get back. Yeah, I'll definitely have a beer when I get back. If we survive this. Um, do we need more of anything? I probably need more kablammies. So, actually, let's do this. I'm going to unplug from you. I'm sure we need more kablammies. What did I just have you make? Okay, now this is all base stuff. I'm gonna need the core. Uh, yeah, so let's load this into the Sky Fortress. Actually, wrong way around. And what does our ammunition situation look like? Not good. Okay, let's put this into main. Container control, we'll take that. Uh, what do we have in the way of weapons and ammo? Could take some extra projectile rifle rounds. Tier 2 pulse rifle. Ah, I have a missile launcher. I have a ton of uh, plasma charges. Okay, we'll take that. Uh, what about the fridge? Is there any food in the fridge? There is. Man, I got food everywhere. Oh, I'm so happy about that. And I got booze in there too. Uh, so let's make a little bit more C4 in case we do have to go up the deep end here. No, not that much. I don't want to use all of our Prometheum. Okay. All right, let's do our checks here. We have food, we have medicine. I don't need this necessarily right now. Probably don't need the drill, but it's good to have on me. We do have two epic drills, so if I lose it, not all that upset. Um, Fuel in O2. Let's go ahead and do that. And I think there's fuel in O2 above the Sky Fortress. Oh, yeah, there is. Excellent. Uh, what food do I have? I'm going to have to take some with me. Yeah, that's not going to work. All right. You're apparently done. Oh, you can make a sandwich, though. Um, let me take the energy bars. And let's change our armor out. Say, excuse me. 
Oh, wow. Yeah, this armor is shot. Okay, I think all of our armor and such is on board the uh, Sky Fortress. In fact, I know it is. So let's go ahead. Do we have any spare 30 mil? I don't believe that we do. Let's make another 700. I will take this. Uh, not you. All right, we should be good to go after this. Uh, yeah. 18 heavy charges. Uh, don't need the mobility boost. I'll leave that here. And I will not be using the EVA boost this time, guys. Do not worry. I know you're all worried. Don't worry. <laughs> no reason to use the EVA boost with heavy armor on a fairly temperate planet. All right, remember... Oh, okay, no, it's, it's like talking to a brick wall, that guy. I'm not sure anything's getting through at all. All right, you know what? Uh, finish. Okay. All right, Sky Fortress. Ammo. Let's take whatever you just made, because we are going to try to blow the ever-loving hell out of uh, that Xerox defense there. And as a matter of fact, do I have bunks somewhere? I'm going to need a bunk. I don't think that I do. Ugh. Okay, because I did want to sleep. There's bunks on board the Sky Fortress, so let's roll. Let's get the hell out of here. Uh, Steve, hold my calls uh, and any Vox messages, anything like that. And if you actually find anything on that map of yours, uh, let me know. Oh, and uh, the Merc's out back if you need to escape. But bring it back. Not kidding. Okay. Alright, we here we are. Maybe we will do a night raid. Maybe we will. Let's see. All right, here we go. First things first. Let's get our uh, let's get our armor squared away here. Yep, there's all our goodies. Oh wait, hang on. Um, do that. Jetpack, mobility, heavy armor. Okay. What do we want? Definitely a jetpack boost. Definitely armor boost. And that's gonna really oof. Let's do a multi boost. And do, 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 probably should have got that mobility boost out of the base. Okay, well, I'd rather have this anyway. That's fine. All right. And what do our shields look like? Let's turn our shields on. Oh, our Pentaxa tank is mint. Shield. Power. All right, guys. It's time. It's time. Do I have my cores? Let me make sure I have my cores. Did they go in here? Yeah, they did. I'm almost positive. Oh! Oh, Jesus. I almost made a huge mistake. Huge mistake. Uh, I'm going to take this and this. Oh, I can't, can't, can't take all that, can I? Sky Fortress. Um, almost forgot the whole reason that we were going, which is to set down some damn auto miners. Come on, man. All right. Get it together, Mike. How many shotgun shells do I have? That's enough. All right, lights. Okay, now let's set a course. Yeah, I'm really upset that we didn't get, that the map reveal didn't take, even though we can obviously see this. Uh, the rest of the map I still have to explore, but. All right, let's bring her about to the south. There we go. Promethium deposit. And you know what? With the speed that we're going, I'm going to space. I don't have to do this. Yeah, that's going to be way too long. Hopefully I brought enough food since I am wearing heavy armor. Alright, up we go, up we go. Let's go. Oh, shit. I left the back open. That's fine. I'm sure I'm sure nothing will happen. I'm sure nothing bad will happen because of that. All right. Now before I land, uh, why am I using thrusters? Before I land, let's make sure our devices, where's our turrets? Okay. No, no predator. Uh, NPC drones, players, okay. Bases. 
Turret. Mounted weapon. The rest of it I will handle. Okay, coming up on the Promethean deposit. Let's start to bring her down. As a matter of fact, there we go. We are dropping right on top of this thing and hope that it works, guys. I did not back up this game. All right, yeah, we're gonna, let's actually, oh, that might not be a good thing. Okay, Xerox defense. We're gonna drop in on top of that first, but let me shut the back. I don't want a ramp getting shot off for some stupid reason. Actually, let me level the ship first. That would be a smart thing to do. All right. Ow. Didn't want to come down here. I don't I don't want to be down here. Oh. Fuck. Okay, good start. Off to a good start. Yeah. All right, here we go. Yeah, I'm moving pretty slow, guys, so I won't be doing much dipping, diving, ducking or dodging. Oh. I mean, did I not turn my signals on? Signals. Yeah, okay, let's get it. Shouldn't have to do that myself. There we go. Much better. Alright, let's see. Now, this thing held up against an Epsilon resistor. Let's see how it does against a proper uh, defense. Uh, POI defense. Defense POI, also known as. Alright, yeah, let's move in on top of this thing and try to stay out of range of the bioweapons lab, because I'm sure that thing is probably pretty, pretty well armed. Here we go. What is that thing over there again? Just patrol HQ. All right, here we go. Oh God, I gotta be prepared to pull the hell off this thing if uh, it chews our shields up, which I think we're at a good angle to start to uh, blast it. But we gotta be much closer. Okay, looks like our turrets are coming to life. Are they? Okay, we should be within range any minute now. There they go. There they go. Yes! Okay, and we're taking fire, and we're taking... Oh god, they are eating our shields up. There we go. Okay, I think we can take on this thing. There. Yes, we can. Whew, that was close. Okay, that thing is a big fat jerk over there, whatever that thing is. And I think we're going to have to edge around the outside to get the defenses down first, because I don't feel good taking on more than uh, one of these things at a time. Alright, let's get this Promethean deposit down before I burst into flames. Jesus Christ. Okay, uh, connect to you here and actually I'm gonna have to probably tap into uh, our own fuel reserves for this ow ow hey hey there who did that I have lasers too who did that oh you oh ow Oh, for Christ's sake, man. Okay, I knew I was dropping into Xerox territory. I'm not... I'm not sorry at all. There's gonna be more. No, not that. I... I do not want to place an auto miner on top of their head to destroy them. Ooh. Man, that's... Ooh. Oh, Jesus. Rocket. Oh, God. We gotta go. We Oh, that's what it is. We just have to leave. We have to leave now and let our turrets do the work. We have to get the hell out of here, guys. Holy crap. I dropped in on top of the entire Xerox army. Go. 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 Let... Come on, turrets. What are you doing? Oh, did I switch you off? That's why. That's why our turrets need to be doing some work here. But they're not. And why? Holy crap, did I not set them to... Uh, troops. 
Troops. Yeah, kill everyone. Oh, wait. Oh, that's... I know. Just whatever. Just start killing, if you would. There we go. There we go. Now we're getting them. Alright. Yeah. Come on. I know there's a lot more down there. There were so many. And for some reason they don't seem to be shooting my ship. Which I am not complaining about. Trust me. Come on. Uh, let's get... Let's tilt. Get all of our turrets in the action here, please. Whew. Oh, man. Yeah, I see you. I see you down there. Any more? Yeah, there's definitely more. What are you guys doing? Get busy. Okay, I didn't think it would be that easy to get in here. Oh, God, this thing is... Yeah, it's swarming with Xerox around here. Look at that. Look at that. I'm glad I brought the CV and not the SV. I was really thinking of bringing the Merc for this job. Just with the Gats. Oh, yeah, look at all that. Okay. Oh, my God. Yeah, look at all of them. Hang on. Let me go ahead and level out. Yeah, they are everywhere. Holy Jesus. Okay, let me go ahead and set down if I can. Hopefully the turrets can deal with the, continue to deal with them. Oh wow, so many Xerax. I could go on a looting spree here. Who's shooting at us that we are not shooting back? There you go. Okay, how's that? All right, Let's set down on this side of the Prometheum. You know, I might not even be in the mood to go get out and loot. Oh, wow. I might just want to plonk this thing down and get the hell on. Yeah, because look at... Oh, my God, it's swarming. <laughs> That's so many Xerox. It's enough Xerox ground troops that it's actually st making a dent in my shields. I'm impressed. Come on. There we go. That's more like it. I, I can still see a guy walking there. You guys. Oh my god, there's so many. Okay. Oh, Jesus, this place crawls. This place crawls. Don't tell me we're out of ammo, right? We're not out of ammo. Oh, we're out of ammo. Okay, so let's go ahead and set down. Looks like we will not be taking on... Wait, did I put it in the wrong one? No, we just simply went through that much ammo on freaking ground troops. Okay, so we're going to have to restock and come back. Because I'm not letting this place go that easy. Alright. Hopefully, hopefully we got rid of enough of them that they will not be bugging us. Because I'm going to get this auto miner down and there's nothing they can do to stop me. Actually, there's a lot they can do to stop me. And they probably will do everything they can to stop Alright. Uh, let's detectorize. Where is this thing? Where is it? Oh, I'm right on top of it. Uh, might be two on top of it. Okay. Let's do this. It's a small deposit, but that's A-OK -okay by me. And we are clipped into it, so hopefully that is not going to be an issue. And let me go ahead and pick up some more from uh, Fuel and O2. Take what I can. Wow, I have 216 of those fuel packs. And it looks like, guys, we have yet another ghost. Yeah, we have another ghost deposit of Prometheum. What the hell? What in the hell? Yeah, I, I mean, I have my ore, scan my ore scanner equipped, and it is just... Son of a bitch. Not again. Okay, well, it looks like we're going to be going to mine asteroids then. I am so furious. I mean, we just killed a lot of Xerax, which is fun and all, but this... What? What? 
Yeah, it's not here. It is not here. It's just not here. Oh my god, that is so aggravating. That is so aggravating. Did I get my auto miner back? Yeah, I did. Did I get my fuel back? I don't think I did. Oh my god. Why do you insist on doing this to me? Oh, okay. Well, you know what? We took out the Xerox defense, and now I know better. I'm just not going to trust any of the deposits on this planet. I can't. Clearly. That doesn't go there. Son of a bitch. Okay. Well. Oh, now we know. You live, you learn. And then you get loves. Okay. I think that's the commercial, right? I don't care. I don't care. We're gonna go take out this... We're gonna go core this defense. The Xerox defense. <clears throat> I was afraid that was gonna happen again. At least I didn't have to expose you guys to two ghost deposits. Because that's... That would just be silly. But there is... Oh, wow. Okay, then. Oh, I didn't get my goddamn auto miner back. Okay, fine. Oh, let's back off. Let's back off. Let me grab it. Ugh. Hopefully no more Xerox patrols come up this way. Ooh, I'm hungry. Ooh, I'm hungry. Furious, guys. Absolutely furious. Uh, I think we got some good fire moss scrapings on the ground here, though, which is helpful. <sighs> or at least I thought I saw him when we were taken off. Yeah, there's one. There's some more. There's some more. Yes, okay. That's gonna make for some good meds. Okay. Alright, let's get out of here. God damn this planet. So far, it's just the Promethium deposits that I've noticed. Obviously, I haven't checked every single kind of deposit yet, but... I just don't... I'm... Uh, give me stupid plant fiber. I don't care. I want everything from this island. I want everything I can carry. Yeah, those two jetpack boosts didn't really help us a lot, did they? Do I have j two jetpack boosts? I do. Yeah, didn't help us much at all. All right, so let's go core this uh, Xerox uh, defense. And there's probably going to be a ton more Xerox over here. Okay, if I could fly less dumbly, that would be good. Okay, can you focus on the ground troops? That would be nice. Okay, then. Yeah, that's right. We can't stick around there. We're still getting hit. Okay. So here's what we're going to do. I have to keep this defense station between us and that other damn POI. <laughs> I'm so angry right now, guys. They screwed me. I did the right thing. I thought I approached this in a fairly smart manner in order to get done what needs to be done. Um, let me take the core now. Uh, container controller. Wow, we really burned through that ammunition fast. And let me go ahead and disconnect from this if I can. Any bad bads? Okay, let's try to get in here without getting blasted by that other POI. In fact, Oh, you. Kabam! Oh, that didn't really work. Thought that'd be a lot more dramatic. Hey, bodies. I love bodies. Get me some muns. Some more laser rifle. More money. More shotgun shells. All the things that make Mike Tannic go round. Alright. I'm coming in. 
Ooh, there is a loot container in this one. Was there a loot container in the last one? I forget. Where's the core? Uh, let me... Ooh, I can't... Ooh, can I take all this? No, I cannot. Yeah, I cannot take that. I'm really interested in that cobalt. Um, copper, whatever. Nah, okay. I'll try to get a little bit closer for us. Uh, where's the core in this? It's got to be down there? Or is it behind? Oop. Oop. Or am I just being an idiot? Probably just being an idiot. How big is this thing? Is there a top? Oh, I shouldn't be up here. I should not be up here. I shouldn't be up here. I, I told you I shouldn't be up there. Don't go up there, Mike. Just don't. <clears throat> Alright. I should be safe enough to spawn in the area unless it's towards the base. Of course, I can almost guarantee it's going to be towards the base because that's how this stuff works. <gasps> it's towards the base! Alright. You know what? I think there's a clone chamber on board the, uh, the strata bomber. Or at least there should be. <laughs> of course it would be towards the base. Why wouldn't it be? Sky Fortress. Why do I keep calling it the Strata Bomber? Is that annoying anyone else? I'm, it's gotta be. Too hot. Wang. What was too hot? Oh, standing near the thingy. Okay. Yeah, yeah, got it. Alright. I'm really upset about that Promethean deposit. That is not okay to do to a person. Or me. What is that? Is that a tree? Huh. That's a depressing tree. That looks like a Neo Rock. Nice to know. Okay, as long as I stay below this crest of the hill, I think I'm okay. I'm not okay here. I'm not okay here. Okay. Stay low. Stay low. Stay low. I gotta figure out where the core in this stupid thing is. All right. Uh, yep. Uh, probably don't do that. Why? Why is this not working? Why are you not working? And do this. Some kablamies, and of course the core. Let's try to get in here without dying. Let's go, let's go. Oh yeah, made it. Wait, did that core it? Did I already core it? Is that what's going on here? Is this thing cored? It is cored. That's why. Oh, you. I don't want, I, I'm not gonna take this thing with me. Oh wait, is that glass there? That's not glass. All right, so I'm gonna put my own core in. Or am I? Not possible. No access possible. Wrong faction. What's really going on here? Okay, no, it is not cord. That is going to be an issue, so... I'm just going to blow the ever-living shit out of all of this. How's that? Oh, and I gotta escape without dying, too. So that would be... Smart to do! Did that do it? No, it did not. But I'm sure it opened up where I need to go. Oh god, open, open the door. Oh. Whew. Okay. Yeah, I may just have to leave that behind. Okay, there's the core. Good god. Uh, can we close that? Thank you. Oh, no, I want the fuel. I want the fuel. Okay. Whew. Oh, there's like nothing in here. Yeah, not even enough to take. Okay, that's fine. Um, anything else of value? No, I think it was just that one loot container. Okay, well, I'm going to take this and probably draw a lot of fire, but that also means that I can uh, multi-tool my way out of here easily. Because I'm sure we're going to start to draw fire now from that other base. Let me out. Um... 
Yeah, guys, I, I'm not going to come back. It was just some common ores. Oh, no, did I get the uh, cobalts? I did. Okay. That's all I really cared about there. Otherwise, it was just common weapons and such. So let's try to get away from this thing. No, 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 no. Keep that between us and them. So Prometheum it is, guys. So, I mean, Prometheum asteroids it is. That's what we're going to have to do. Because this is just not working. Not for me. Uh, I'm not going to continue to chase. There's only one more Prometheum uh, deposit on this planet, and it's heavily guarded. A lot more heavily guarded than this one was. I can imagine. All right. Yeah, let's get this thing out of here. So what I'm going to do, uh, before I come back to finish off this island, I would actually like to take down the rest of these POIs since we already started and see what kind of loot we can get out of these. Uh, I have not attacked a Xerox Bioweapons Lab in some time, guys, so I don't quite recall all what is in there. And if it's even worth pursuing or not, but we're going to try it. So let's, let's head up to space. Do we have oxygen? Oh, we need fuel. Do we need fuel? All right. That'll have to do for now. And let's bleep our blooper here. And it's probably going to be nothing but Xerax. All around here. And yeah, I figured as much. Okay. Let's see what we got here. There is a silicon asteroid. There are also promethium and titanium asteroids. Oh, out way out there. Okay, so let's see where is that one at and how far? Where's the question mark? Okay, this way, I believe. Yep. So let's go ahead and kill our auto break, do a bit of coasting. Yeah, here we are. No, that is the silicon asteroid, I believe, that we are heading directly towards. So let's turn about off this way. This is actually in the complete opposite direction. There we are. Oh, okay, come on. Let's, let's get out of orbit. Do not want to go to orbit. And there's also a Xerax POI there nearby, so I'm guessing that whatever this is could possibly be guarded by the Xerax, and I have no ammunition, and I seriously doubt I have the capacity to manufacture any ammunition, do I? No. Okay. Let's see what we have, because I know we still have a constructor on board. We have a little bit of crushed stone, cobalt, and copper. Yeah, we do not have what it takes. I should have packed so much more ammo, guys. I always go off on adventures that go way farther than I ever meant for them to go. So yeah, we're hosed. So unless I, oh no, I need I need plant fiber if I'm ever going to be able to like build ammunition out in space. So that's just not gonna happen. Let's eat a sandwich and some steak. Come on, there we go. Yeah, this heavy armor is kind of killing us. Okay, guys, I'm going to see what this resource is, and I'll probably go off and explore those other two off camera, and we'll call that an episode. Very disappointing. Very disappointing, if I do say so myself. Uh, my, what I will call victory on this planet, uh, the, our one that we have our base on currently, is taking out the patrol vessel HQ and Xerax Island, which happens to also contain three Prometheum, uh, three titanium, and oh, okay, there we go, titanium asteroids, but still, that isn't necessarily what we need, but we will take it, uh, so I'm going to do a bit of mining, guys, so yeah, once we take out Xerox Island and the patrol ve vessel HQ, I'm going to call that a victory on our planet, because the rest of them, the POIs, that's just gratuitous loot, and you know, if we absolutely need something, if there's a certain kind of, you know, epic weapon I want that we don't have, then yeah, we may hit a few, but from here on out, it's mostly going to be exploration. So we're going to end it here for today, guys. Thank you all so much for watching, and I want to reiterate again my thanks to all of you for 
all of your support through the past week, which has been a difficult one, but we got through it. We're back. I love you guys so much for watching. I will see you in the next episode. Mike Tannick out.